Since the birth of Dolly the sheep in 1996, scientists have managed to clone about 20 species, including cats, goats, and sheep. Now they've taken a step towards something a lot more controversial, cloning a human. Disney Channel stars grown in the Disney Genetic Engineering Lab will be unveiled to the public. So the stars that we see on TV are actually grown right here. Uh, that's correct. They're, they're grown and uh, developed here. We engineer their brains for advanced singing and dancing capabilities, even posing for photo. By the time they grow to desired size, uh, these child stars are fully ready for the camera or the, the concert uh, tours or whatever Disney chooses to put them in. You're not real. You're not like a real person, like me. You're clones. You're copies of people out here in the world. Or one of them gets sick and they need a new part, they, they take it from you.
it is possible that the ancient astronauts taught the Egyptians that mummification was a way of preserving their genetic information in the DNA. This makes it possible to clone ancient mummies and, in a sense, bring them back to life. What did you say? Bring them back to life. ኢትዮጵያውያን እንጂ በጣም ያጠናሉ ለምን እንደሆነ ውስጥ ይሄን ነገር ላይ አዌርነስ ፈጣሪ ዶክተርና ምን ብለው በኢሜልም በምንም ያካፈሉኝ ወጣት በህክምናው ውስጥ ያሉ ተማሪዎች ሁሉ አሉ።